hey guys welcome back to my channel so i know i switched it up i got a little dark hair moment going on because you know when i think of fall i think of all the warm tones i think of 90s vibes so i feel like i'm channeling all the 90s right now i'm gonna be showing you guys some of my favorite fall lippies so please don't forget to like comment and subscribe to my channel if you like my content and without any further ado let's go ahead and get into this video so before we talk about combos let's talk about some of my favorite lip liners okay honestly you just need a really good brown lip liner i like to have a variety so i'm going to show you some of my favorite lip liners i'm going to start with my favorite formula which is the morphe liners okay so here i have toasty and date night so toasty is going to be that nice warm brown liner and then date night is more of a plum um, like a darkened plum. I really like this with um, like my reds. Next, I have this NYX Slide On Glide On Lip Liner. This is in the shade Urban Cafe, and this is really creamy. I would say that this is very comparable to um, the next um, lip liner that I'm going to talk about. Um, it's very creamy on the lips and that is Urban Cafe. And then we have one of the creamiest formulas. Um, this is going to be the Jaclyn Cosmetics in Bold Brew. And that is what the Jaclyn looks like. So as you can see, these two look very similar. So it looks like we found like a dupe for the Jaclyn lip liners so pick you up those nyx slide on glide on formulas because those are really bomb and if you can save some coin you know why not last but not least is the sephora collection liner in molasses and this is a retractable lip liner so you don't sharpen these you just twist it up and this one is very very creamy i would say it's a little bit more creamier than the um than the Jacqueline and that is what molasses looks like so we have toasty date night urban cafe bold brew and molasses so now that i have the lip liners out of the way let's talk about the lip combos so we'll start with the one that i have on currently i am wearing the jacqueline bold brew liner and for lipstick i have the huda beauty matte lipstick in staycation and i feel like this is the perfect like nude um it's definitely giving me like those 90 vibes i like more brown tone um lipsticks warm cool in the fall of course you can wear them all year long but this is just what i like to use so this is lip combo number one so now i'm taking urban cafe and i still have a little bit of that liner left over i'm just gonna clean her up a little bit The next formula I'm going to be talking about is so bomb. Like if you don't have any of these liquid lipsticks, you are definitely sleeping on them. And I'm talking about the Dose of Colors liquid lipsticks, okay? Um, I'm literally obsessed with Kevin Luong on Instagram. And um, when he was just like going super like viral for his work and things like that, his lip combos that he would use was like... KKW and Dose of Colors. So I already liked Dose of Colors and it just made me buy a lot more lipsticks. So I'm gonna start with Cork. And this is just a beautiful warm tone brown. And that is what Cork looks like swatched. 
and I'm going to apply her onto the lips. And this is what cork looks like. So this is very much 90s. It's giving, you know, that perfect nude. This is cork from Dose of Colors. And my next lip, I'm going to be using my Boo Gigi, okay, Glam by Gigi. Um, this is going to be what her Instagram looks like. Y'all definitely go follow her. Her lip combos are so beautiful and they look great on our skin tone. Um, but she definitely put me on to this lip because I would not pick something out like this. Um, this is going to be the Jaclyn Cosmetics Pout Spoken Liquid Lip and this is in the shade Gratitude. And Gratitude is definitely a lot more warmer. Um, so yeah, definitely not a shade I would pick up. It looks so good on her. I had to try it out for myself. And this is definitely similar to the last lip, but it's clearly a lot warmer. It does have more of that orange, like rust you know color that's perfect for the fall it's gonna look so good with like your flannels and things like that so this is gratitude and next is an og brand this is going to be the mac powder kiss lipstick in marrakesh and if you really like a warm lip honey this is a warm lip and these are so soft and smooth and aren't like drying on the lips. So it's super comfortable to wear. And this is what Marrakesh looks like. So it's definitely that burnt orange fall color, super gorgeous. And as you can see, like in comparison to the other lipsticks that I've tried on, this is definitely going to be like so bomb. And I'm just going to deepen this up with molasses just because I want that defined lip. And this is what Marrakesh looks like. So it's definitely that beautiful burnt orange rust color and it looks good with any like smoky eye any warm toned eye it is the perfect burnt orange shade for the fall and now we're going to be going into really a really vampy lip shade so i'm going to be taking date night from morphe to line my lips and i still have a little bit of that liner on but I still have a little bit of the other liner on but that's okay for the next lip shade I'm going to be taking the Fenty Beauty Stunna Lip Paint in Underdog so this is going to be that beautiful burgundy shade that's perfect that literally screams fall and it's perfect for date night too and here is a swatch of underdog on my skin tone and this is definitely more of a liquid formula so be careful when applying this and this is what underdog looks like so it really makes your teeth look super white and it is just such a flattering color. And this is Underdog with Morphe Date Night. So I'm gonna go ahead and line my lips with the Sephora Collection Molasses.
and I have to end this video with this beautiful shade. This is also Dose of Colors in the shade Chocolate Wasted. And that is what Chocolate Wasted looks like. So it is definitely a really beautiful brown shade, not too dark. It's definitely giving milk chocolate. And you definitely have to have a brown lip. You definitely need a nice warm tone lip and then a beautiful like brown lip. And this is Chocolate Wasted on Me and it's so perfect. It's so flattering and it just screams 90s and I just love how it looks. And yeah guys, so that concludes the end of this video. If you guys like these type of videos, I definitely have a lot more lip combos I can share, especially for the fall slash winter time. I'm just like so ready for fall, even though it's still hot as hell here in Texas, but I am just channeling all the fall vibes right now. But yeah, those are just a few of my um, favorite lips that I like to wear for the fall. If you guys wanna see a more affordable version of this, definitely let me know down in the comments. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.